All right, we're going to solve this. We're going to find the inverse, and we'll check. So y is going to be equal to 4x plus 2. So for the inverse, we swap them. So we get x is equal to 4y plus 2. Now we're going to solve for y. So we're going to get um, 4y, subtract 2 first, x minus 2, and then divide through by 4. So the inverse function, um, f raised to the negative 1 is the same thing as just saying y is equal to um, is equal to x minus 2 over 4. All right, so if you graph this, um, it's going to look something like it's going to look something like this if you graph it. And to do a quick check, we can just plug x and y into each other. I mean, you're supposed to test it both ways, but I think once is enough. So we'll just plug f of negative 1 into f of x. So you get 4 times quantity x minus 2 over 4 plus 2. So fours cancel out, we get x minus two plus two. Twos cancel out, we just get x. So it works out. All right, that's how you find the inverse of this function f of x is equal to four x plus two.